I built awesome looking digital LED clock with thermometer function and some cool LED effects. Hello Hacktubers and welcome back to my channel. Today DIY project is building from zero electronic digital LED clock using PCB board and all necessary electronic components so can the clock work properly to remember the time when power is off. Beside the quality PCB board, let me tell you the most important components for making this clock are the single chip microcontroller STC15W408AC with 28 pin holder for that, DS1302 timekeeping chip that need to be powered by external lithium battery and 32 kHz crystal oscillator, thermistor for measuring the temperature, photoresistor as light sensor, a active buzzer for alarm, two push switches, 10 LEDs are red, 50 are blue, resistors and capacitors. You can see the schematic for this DIY electronic LED clock that you can make it by yourself if you enjoy in, in electronics. Ok, now when I organize all parts it's time for building the clock. First I'm gonna start with placing the resistor and solder them all and cut the wires with pliers. Next is placing the dip holders for the chips, microcontroller clock chip and time keeping chip holder. So far building progress is very good and next electronic component is a lithium battery holder for DS1302 time clock chip. Just letting you know that this battery keeps the time always on time where there is no power to clock itself. Soldering the piezo active buzzer to inform you that this clock has 24 hour alarm that I can set up and make the sound through the, that buzzer. There are two push buttons for setting up the time and for choosing the LED effect. Crystal oscillator and two ceramic capacitors of 10 nanofarads are components who are crucial for keeping the time beating correct. Without crystal oscillator of 32 kHz we can't have correct time. Mini female USB connector is for powering the device and with the USB cable connected to 5V power adapter that this clock will work. I came to the part where I need to place and solder 60 LEDs, those are 3mm and 10 of them are red indicating the hours and 50 blue LEDs are for the seconds. With soldering all 60 LEDs and I am in 70% done with this project and take a look what amazing job I have done so far. The clock is turning to be amazing gadget. Next is adding the 4 digit 7 segment display. This video is sponsored by JLC PCB, the fastest one-stop electronic manufacturing. 
if you need to order printing circuit boards like mine clock project visit the JLC PCB service and they offer 5 PCBs 1 to 4 layers for only $2. Only you need to do is upload your Gerber file to instant quote, choose base material, how many layers you have your board, color picking, how many pieces you want of the board and with just few clicks you can order your custom design board and receive it from the fastest service right now. Also, JLC PCB offer 6 to 8 layer PCB for only $2 for 5 pieces with dimension of 50 by 50 mm. Other services are available like flexible PCBs, they have PCB assemble, SMT stencil, 3D printing, CNC machining and mechatronic parts. To mention, all electronic components that you need for the project can be found on JLC PCB Parts website. They have all the components for building your project. Everything is organized, perfect, audio components, battery products, capacitor, circuit protection and many more. For more info, visit the link below this video and remember, JLC PCB is one-stop solution for every electronic dream. I came to the part when it's time to place the chips in socket. Before first time testing the clock, I'm gonna be sure that every electronic component is correctly soldered and that all components are in place. Yes, the clock is working fine, but I need to add one more detail to the device and that is transparent plexiglass pieces, one at front and one on back and with adding those two plexiglasses I will protect the PCB board and the components and in the same time I will give the clock much better and cool look. My DIY digital electronic LED clock is 100% finished. All electronic components are perfect soldered and with adding the crystal clear plastic panels at front and back, the clock itself turned out futuristic. And the best part is that you can see all the electronics and how the clock is working. As I told you, with using a mini USB cable, I will power the, this clock and it's time to show you how it's working and see it in action. With those two buttons behind, I can set the time and the alarm. Now take a look what kind of LED effects can be performed using 60 LEDs on front panel. Don't forget that besides showing the time, this gadget can show the room temperature and measuring with the thermistor sensor that I placed before. It's a nice feature to show the temperature and time. I will turn off the lights in my studio just to show you how is looking this beautiful multifunctional LED clock in dark.
We came to the end of this video and I hope that you enjoy in my clock project. Please give a like to support the channel and share the video will help too. Thank you for watching.